What's up, y'all? Thanks for tuning into my YouTube channel today. So, um, for this video, I'm gonna do another version of cauliflower wings that I love to make. And with this version, I'm going to use, and I know it sounds weird, but I'm gonna use mayonnaise and mustard. And then I'm going to dip them in the um, garbanzo bean flour and my egg replacer as well. So that's what I'm gonna use today. And I know it sounds so weird, but I just remember whenever I was eating meat and I was cooking fish, what I did whenever I was cooking fish was I would dip them in a mayonnaise and mustard mixture with seasonings, and then I would um, dip it in some breadcrumbs, I believe, and then I put it in the air fryer. And it was so good, y'all. And so I'm like, I wonder if it's gonna taste just as good with some cauliflower wings. And I'm gonna get some seasoning similar to what I used with the fish seasoning. Okay, yeah, so let's try this out and y'all <laughs> i hope it tastes good i hope it turns out good y'all okay so what we're gonna use let me put my phone down so i didn't really measure this but i used about maybe like a cup of chickpea flour and then um i did a tablespoon of this egg replacer and um i didn't add any water because the mayonnaise and the mustard mixture is going to help it stick to the flour so that's what I'm gonna do, and let me see if I can move my phone over. Okay, so I already cut up my cauliflower wings like this. All right, so let's go ahead and preheat our oven, and I'm gonna preheat to about 420. And we're gonna cook the cauliflowers on 420 for about 25 to 30 minutes. Okay, so we're gonna add about a cup of mayonnaise. I didn't really measure this, but I believe this is about a cup then we're going to add about a tablespoon of honey mustard and stir really well now add your seasonings some salt and you know i love my fajita seasoning that's my favorite seasoning we're going to add some of this as well Okay, now let's toss the cauliflower in the mixture and then we're going to toss the cauliflower into the chickpea flour just like this. So I ran out, so I'm gonna make another mixture. I'm gonna use another cup of the mayonnaise and about a tablespoon of the honey mustard. And I'm gonna stir that really well. Add the same seasoning, some sea salt and some fajita seasoning. And then I'm going to throw and toss in the rest of the cauliflower. And for the record, this is the mayonnaise that I'm using and this is the honey mustard that I'm using. I like Hellman's the most, so. And this is how they look once they are all coated and ready to go in the oven. As you can see, they look good. I coated them really well. So let's go ahead and pop them in the oven. cook in the oven for about 25 minutes and I'm going to check them at 25 minutes and see if they are soft enough inside and if not then I might put them back in the oven for about five more minutes but while I wait for those I'm going to go ahead and wash my dishes because they're getting kind of full so let me wash those and then we'll come back to get the cauliflower ones.
All right, let's taste these bad boys. They look so good. Good. Didn't even need to put nothing on it. It tastes so good by itself. Y'all. Like, I knew that these were gonna be so good. They are so good. So good. Y'all have to try these out. Let me know how y'all like them, y'all. They came out so good. Maybe go easy on the salt, though. Maybe don't put too much salt. But. They're so good, y'all. <laughs> Alright, y'all, so I'm about to wrap up this video because I'm getting pretty sleepy and I'm ready to get my butt in the bed. So I'm going to take my clothes off and get my butt in the bed. So um, I do want to say thank y'all for tuning in to my YouTube channel. Um, and I will see y'all in my next video. It'll probably be on Friday because that's probably the next time I'm going to be cooking. So I will see y'all on Friday.